Hello everyone, Sons and Duck 2, welcome to another mod overview, this time on HUD Compass. A mod simply adds in a compass that also allows you to set waypoints. So I'm just going to get rid of a few of these here that I've got. Uh, so by default I'm pretty sure you get a home one, which I assume is just maybe where spawn is or where you end up in the world when you've installed it probably. Uh, and then from there you've also got a few keybinds you can use to create your own. So you'll find them around about here, so onto miscellaneous, you see the following. Now there is no actual keybinds set by default, so I've just added my own. And I'll just put those back so I remember what they are. Um, so you've got a quick waypoint, which is just the ability to set one up uh, with the keybind itself. You've got the ability to remove some with keybind, and you've got an editor so that you can um, do a bit more to access them, create new ones from the, the editor, and so on. So we'll just go with the keybinds I've set. So we'll just go here. You can see I've got one over there. I'll just do this because it makes it kind of easier. I nearly created one to kind of focus on it. Maybe it's just not going to here. I don't know, I haven't gotten used to it just yet, but yeah, so you can see there's waypoints there and there. So it's the home one. Uh, we've got the ability to obviously remove it, which I'm doing there. And if we go to the waypoint editor, you can see we don't have any there, but if we create a new one, we can just call it custom waypoint one. And you can see the coordinates are obviously exactly where we're positioned. Um, I don't know if that means you can expand upon things, and that's where you can delete. So we just go, say, waypoint 2. Um, it's obviously the same position, but if I wanted to change it, I could. So just go, I guess, 8, and we'll go, I don't know, 71 or something, and tweak that so we can save. We can see custom 2's there and custom 1's there. So that's and obviously we can edit whatever we want. Um, okay, maybe that just might be sort of like an auto sort of thing? Or it's only focusing on the first one? So that's not the home one then. Interesting. Okay, I thought that would have been. Now you get the ability to toggle um, which ones you see, just with the button here. And if we go to say the nether, we can see our options there. I don't know if there is much else I've missed, so I'm going to have to check the page description. But uh, that's pretty much, I assume, most of the mod or the basics. Um, we'll have to see though. So we just go here, which shows the nether, but there's nothing there. So if I just actually set one, um, like so, and there's no home one there, so there's that. So I'll just do this, and you can see there's just the um, sort of manual, uh, sorry, key binding one compared to the in editor ones. Um, you don't have to worry about saving either. So, yeah. Uh, if we go to here, what else is there? It's the ability to do, uh, let's see, so you've got vanilla map waypoints, be displayed in the compass, can be disabled, uh, respawn location will be displayed in the compass. Um, let's see, I don't know if that means where you are. I'm um, assuming that's for beds and such, possibly. I don't know if I'd count all of them, unless it's respawn anchors. Not sure. Um, and then you've got um, waypoints will be stored server side, uh, several provided that anyone can see, and there is waypoint sharing as well. So maybe that's the sending one? Maybe that's actually a sending one to other players, it's just I'm in single player, so it's not going to show anything for me. Um, let's see, that's all the extra stuff, um, can be used in two ways, with and without the server, running in client side mode, the mod displays waypoints stored in the client and will integrate with the following minimap to show the minimap waypoints in the compass, so they can kind of work together if you have that mod installed. I'm just going to show it as it's normally presented if you don't have the set mod installed, um, but that seems to be pretty much it. Thanks so much for watching and goodbye.